In this Python tutorial, we will create a GUI application containing a slider object using the py simple GUI library. After the name and surname values are entered, we can adjust our age using the slider object. As soon as the slider object starts to move, the age value is simultaneously updated in the text object. We will remake the project together. In the video I will show you how to do it step by step. To support us, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video. So let's start. First, I will transfer the PY Simple GUI library. You can transfer the library using this code. I import the library. I am creating an object list. I add the text object to the list. I create a variable for the window. I send the title, layout and size values to the window function. I create an infinite while loop with true. I will create two variables named event and values. I synchronize the variables with the read function. Using these variables, I determine the operations to be performed in the application. For example, when the X button is pressed, the event variable becomes equal to none. If the X button is pressed, I will end the while loop with the break command. Finally, I close the window. I created a window containing a text object. Now I add an input object to the list. I added the input object to the desktop window. I add the text and input object for the surname to the list. I added input objects for name and surname to the window. I am creating a text object for age. Now I will create a slider object. I send range, enable events, expand and orientation values to the slider function. I added the slider object to the desktop window. Now I create a text object to display the name, surname and age values. I need to access input, slider and text objects. I will define keys to access objects. I can access objects with the keys I define. If the event value is age, I will create a text variable. I can access the data entered by the user by using key values with values. I save the name, surname and age values to the text variable. I will change the text object using update. I send the text variable to the update function. After entering the name and surname values, the resulting text object changes synchronously when the slider object changes. In the next video, we will make an example of a list box. To support us, you can subscribe to the YouTube channel and like the video.